all right guys in this video i'm going to show you how to bind your uh, binance api to tafabot so that tafabot as a tool it will help you to be closing position and be making profit for you every second you understand what that means is huge amount of money so for those of you who don't know who what tafabot is it's a tool uh, that help you it's a bot that help you to customize your own bot, set your stop loss, set your you know average and so many other things, your take profit and uh, this bot while you are busy cooking your egusi soup or while you are busy working in your office, it will be scalping you know a dollar for you in profit. At the end of the day, you should not have something you know when the market is good, you should have huge profit. So let me just show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so for you for Tafa bot as a tool to start you know a closing profit for you you need to connect the api of your exchange platform in this case we are connected the how to connect api of Binance to tafa about spot trading and also future uh, trade or wallet okay so we have to connect them together so that they will be able to be closing profit for you remember the only access tafa about we have to your exchange platform Binance is to trade for you you know, Binance will not, or any of the exchange platform will not allow any tool to do any other thing or to withdraw your money. It's not possible, okay? So when I talk about profit, look at it. Remember, I'm shooting this video right now, 11.48 p.m. Tuesday, November 22. It's night time, right? So now you can see uh, my, it is night already. So this one, everything here turns zero. I actually made some transaction today. Look at this uh, profit. Look at this timing november 11 which is the same time 17 18 p.m so look at it read the time this is also today in the daytime so the total profit i make today let me show you with these two that it closed for me so that you know you have to connect this so that you start making money with it let me go to my screenshot so that you confirm yourself and verify are you seeing what i made today this is what with this for 24 hours time i made 42 dollar and the trading amount in my future wallet on binance i started with 16 dollar 60 dollar so now look at the time for you to verify are you seeing that this screenshot it was the same screenshot you are seeing on my tafabot uh, uh, app right this is the app on tafabot this is the app right i went to profit so compare it with that screen you find that it is the same thing it was today that i made this uh it's just that the time that the, the tool is using have run off after it's now after 24 hours, everything now is zero. So because I've, it's a new day now according to the tool, Tafabot. So now you can see the profit a low trading with $60. So do you think you can do this as human? You sit with your phone or your computer and be closing zero point. Are you seeing the, 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 the dollar they were closing? At, at seconds, 50 seconds, the dollar that was being closed. So it is only Tafabot that can close such small small amount for you at the end of the day you will have something like this with 60 dollar 100 dollar in your future wallet on balance you have this so this is not why we are here why we are here is actually to how to bind the api so that tafabot will start uh, trading for you on uh, binance or any other platform but in this case we are going for binance so how you do that is that you come to your tafabot app when you are in your tafabot i uh, just click on this exchange okay so you click on exchange and once you click on exchange then go for you know you can see depending on the actual platform kucoin uh, binance is there kucoin is there by Bitrex is there babit is there and wobi those are the ones available for now and uh, you are going to connect the api for band uh, for what is spot and for future so now how do you do that you are going for binance so you are going to your binance account right now okay you are going to your binance app right now and once I'm in my Binance app, I will click on the home. And once I'm at home on my Binance, I'm going to click on this more. Okay. Hope you can see more here. So I'm going to click on more. And once I'm in more, I will scroll down to the end. And I will click on API management. Okay. So once I click on API management, so now uh, once you are in API management, you are going to create, click on create API. Okay. So once you click on create API, so Binance is going to tell you to, you know, uh, label API key. You can just put any name of your choice, okay? I'll just put TAF, one, two, three, 
for example. So I'll just click on create. And the banners will tell you to complete this security. Make sure you just click it and place it where it's supposed to be. And once you have done that, Binance will send your security code. And uh, if you are using only one, you just click on get code, okay? Click on get code for email and uh, for phone, okay? So once you have done that, you will now see that the, the it will be generated, okay? Like this, something like this. Are you seeing it? Something like this, like the key. This is how it's going to be. So the next thing you are going to do is click on this edit. Okay, you click on edit. And once you click on edit, then you click on this drop down arrow here. Okay, so once you click it, so now it's going to show you copy this API key, put it somewhere safe, like um, your Google Chrome. Then copy this secret key. This is not how it's going to appear. It's going to appear something like this also. Copy both. Name this one API key. This one's uh, secret key. This is the most important one you should you must copy. Okay? You can see you cannot read this anymore. So that is the only time you have to copy it and go and paste it. Then come back. Once you are back, the next thing you have to do is that make sure this one is highlighted automatically already. Make sure you click on this one. Check it like this. You know, enable spot and margin trading, then enable future trading. These are the things that need to be enabled, okay? So, you can see for you to even confirm, you cannot even enable to withdraw. So, no no tool. Tafabo cannot withdraw your money. You know that. But it's not possible for it to be even enabled. It is disabled automatically by Binance. So, those are the three things you need to enable. This one have already been enabled automatically. Just check on this one, which is enable spot and margin trading and also enabled future trading because those are the trading you are going to be doing. So once you have done that, then you click on on, uh, on save. So that's about, uh, sorry, Binance will also tell you to bring the security again. You click on get code and the security, will, uh, the code will be sent to you. You put it and it will tell you successfully created. So remember, you have copied them and put in one place. So now we are going to go back to our Tafabot account, Tafabot app. Then we are, we are, remember where we come from. We are on exchange and API here, exchange and API. You click there and uh, remember it's Binance. So we say, we click on here, okay? We click on this Binance area. And once we are here, the API key you copy, put the API here, copy and paste it here. Then the secret, the Binance API secret key, the API secret key we copied, put it here. So once you put it here, then you see connect in this area, connect, okay? So uh, in case there's any problem, there's any issue, don't disconnect, always come and replace, Let another one and come and replace, okay? So now that is how to do it. And remember, we're on future, on spot. You have banned your spot uh, trading, uh, wallet to uh, to Tafabot, your Binance Spot Trading Wallet to Tafabot. So now you have to now bind your Future Wallet API to Tafabot. So you click on Future, then you click on Binance again. For example, you see if it's successfully uh, connected, like if Spot successfully connected, the amount in your Spot account, you understand? So it's going to display here, okay? I don't know why this one is not displaying. I actually have some fault, but the future you can see it is displaying. So it's going to display. The amount you have on your Binance is going to display. So you do the same thing for future. You click and you paste that same uh, API key at that same secret key here. Okay, and you click on connect. So that is why you need to copy it and paste it somewhere at the beginning. So once it's successful collected for you to confirm, or if you once you come here, you click on future you will see your balance in your Binance account. If you click on spot, if you have some crypto in your spot, you will see the balance in your spot, okay? So that is how it is being done, guys. So that is how to connect your, um, you know, Binance API uh, on spot and also future API of Binance to Tafabot. Subscribe to this channel and turn on the bell notification as I'm going to be bringing more educational tutorial on how to make money on Tafabot and crypto trading on Binance. Thank you. We meet in the next video.